to be Jack live for the Bucky House. And on today's show, we are burying a time capsule. I know, I'm excited about it too, audience. You can do this too, everyone. All you have to do is assemble a bunch of things that will trigger memories and then put them in a weatherproof container and bury them somewhere that you'll remember. And that remembering part is very important. If you just put them in a hole and forget, it's kind of not worth the effort. Let's meet our next time capsuler. Say hello, me monkey dots, to Julian! Hey, Julian, how are you? Hey, welcome to the monkey house. So as you know, we're sticking things in this time capsule that are going to scream 2019 to everyone who opens it up. They'll just know exactly what it was like to be alive today. Tell us, Julian, what do you want to put in there? A flash drive of movies that are new today. Oh, I see. So, uh, 2019 movies that are, like, hitting uh, the screens just right now. Brand new movies that people are loving. And we'll put them on a flash drive. Uh, hopefully flash drives are still usable in 20 years. We don't know about that. And then we'll remember the movies that made us excited uh, when we're all older, 20 years from now. So what movies would be on that flash drive, Julian? Um, Spider-Man to the Spider-Verse. Oh, yeah. Right. And Avengers Endgame. Endgame. Oh, yeah. So a lot of, um, a lot of superhero movies. What about any non-superhero movies, or will it only be superhero movies? Well, I haven't really thought of any superhero movies. I saw a really great documentary two days ago, uh, or no, yesterday, during my sick day, uh, about um, a guy that went to go see The Price is Right 37 times. So maybe we could put that one on there, too. It's just like a big yeah, fan of The Price is Right. That seems interesting. You should do that. Yeah, it's sort of interesting. <laughs> Once you start watching it, you're like, ah, maybe not as interesting as I thought. But yeah, okay, we'll stick that one on there, too. I hear there's a great movie being made about skee-ball, a documentary, so that would be good. Okay, so uh, we'll crowdsource this. We'll put everyone's favorite movies on this uh, thumb drive. We'll stick it in the time capsule. We'll hope that we don't get busted for any anti-piracy uh, laws. And then 20 years from now, we'll have a bunch of movies to watch. That's exciting, right, Julian? Yeah, maybe we should create our own movie so we don't get busted by the piracy laws. Oh, good idea. Okay, so we'll reenact all of these movies. That way, uh, we won't be uh, 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 suspected of lifting any intellectual property. Like, we'll do like a shot-for-shot -shot remake of Avengers Endgame with us playing the superheroes. So, which superhero do you want to be, Julian? Iron Man. Iron Man. Oh, good choice. I think, um, who am I going to be? Uh... I want to be Groot, just because I'm terrible at remembering lines, and that way, uh, you know, there's only three words that you gotta memorize. <laughs> that would be a perfect role for me. Plus, I'm mostly made out of, uh, like, old tree bark. Audience, give it up for Julian in New Jersey, who just skirted anti-piracy laws. We're putting movies in there.